Another episode? Yeah, go on. Daniel never watches these game shows with me. Uh, oh, except for that impossible one on BBC Two where the questions don't even make sense. I love them. Me too. I'm really glad you came over. So am I. Been really lonely. Miss Crystal. Ryan. Not, not Crystal, but... I just really felt like she understood me. She seemed to. Which just makes it all the harder because, you know, I know she was a stranger. I've missed you too. I'm sorry, I was an idiot. Kissing you like that, I... I don't know what happened. I do. You felt sorry for me. No. Of course you did. No, I... Uh, I kissed you because... because I wanted to kiss you. I did want to kiss you, too. Yeah, well, I'm glad you didn't. I still do. Which is why seeing you is a bad idea. Yeah, it's definitely a bad idea. Emma. No, no, not at all. Now we're just watching. Just uh, watching some telly. Uh, yeah. uh. Right, well, I, sh I should be going. Oh, no, yeah. no, no, you don't. Don't get up my account and I'll get you another beer. I've got some wine here. No, honestly, it's, it's all right. Oh, I'll... shut up and sit down. I've got some posh crisps too. Get your glass. <laughs> beer. I knew Daniel was going to pop round, but I didn't expect to see you. Yeah, I'm just the second less important friend to come visit. Oh, well, you can't be that unimportant because he's not hung around with anybody for ages properly, have you? Cheers. Well, it's true, though, babe, isn't it? Anyway, I'm glad. Whatever you're doing, keep doing it. Oh, it was nice of Daniel to pop in, wasn't it? Yeah. Yeah, I really should get back to the pub. Ryan, why don't you go with her? Get out of the flat, have a few drinks. No, I'm a bit short of cash. Oh, don't be daft. I can shout you a couple of drinks. No, honestly, it's... Uh... It's fine. Um, maybe we can hang out again soon sometime. I've enjoyed it. Yeah, me too. But, you know, in the meantime, do go out. <laughs> Not with me, obviously. <laughs> and if you can only take one thing from today, you've got to forget about Crystal. People will see past your scars, Ryan. Remember that. Well, I never thought I'd say this. That was Daisy speaking a lot of sense. Happy Father's Day. Oh, thank you very much. What have we got in here? Socks. How did you know I needed socks? There's a card, isn't there? Hmm. Did you do this? Mm. To Adam, happy Father's Day. I love you very much. Well, to be fair, it is it's quite a difficult word, so... So does Mummy, but I chose the socks. Mm. <laughs> He's right about that. About both things. You finished? Sadly, I think I am. Can I get you anything else? No, thanks. That was perfect. Where was that? Yeah. Wait, uh, wait, wait. Uh, actually... You know what? Change my mind. Why? There's too many people in there. I just don't feel up to facing. OK, um... About speed down. Uh, you can face Ali, can't you? Yeah, well, I wasn't great to her last time we met. She came into the hospital to see me, and I told her I didn't need another friend. Ryan, you were traumatized. She'll understand. Yeah, all right then. Speed down, please. Ryan, hey, you look well.
Well, no, I mean, um, I mean, I mean, it's good to see you out and about. It's all right. I know I look like a horror show. <laughs> well, no worse than me first thing in the morning. <laughs> Should I just put me foot in my mouth again? I'd just go. Yeah. Yeah, I'll just go. Oh, no, 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 oh. you don't. Don't. Ryan, remember what Daisy said, OK? They'll see past it. You are beautiful. Come on. Come on. Oh, it's so great to see you. Is it? Yeah, of course it is. I've been thinking about you loads, but... I told you I didn't need another friend. Yeah. Yeah, I'm an idiot. We didn't want people fussing over you, I understand. Ah, oh, see, you told you. But I have been asking Daisy about you, though. Hope you don't mind. Yeah? What's she been saying? Well, just how brave you are. How strong, testifying at trial. Mm. Oh, yeah, I couldn't have done her without her, though. She's been great today. She's a good person. I mean, I wouldn't have said that a couple of years ago, <laughs> but... <laughs> <laughs> well, she's... she's changed. Yeah, I think you're right. I think Daniel might have changed her. Maybe. I'm going to nip to the shop, all right? I'll see you back at the flat. All right, see you. Oh, it's so good to catch up with you. You too. I didn't know about Crystal, that she was Karen. It must have been such a shock. Yeah, it never shocked me. It sent me right back, to be honest. I wish I could have been there for you more. It's all right. Carl's been doing it. And Daisy, like I said, it's been amazing today. Well, I'm glad you two are close. And I mean that. Hi. Oh. You're not supposed to be anywhere near me. Yeah, I was just getting a kebab. You all right? Yeah. Look, I'm going to go. Um, hopefully see you soon, yeah? Mm, definitely. But that wasn't my fault. I can't blame her for acting like that, then. No, but I've tried to apologise. I think what you did is beyond an apology, love. Yeah, I know. But I'm not a totally bad person. I helped you when you needed it. Yeah, we were. I'm the one who told Daniel about your message. No one would come otherwise, would they? Sorry? What? what? Message what? When you collapsed. I was in the STC, Daniel lent me Daisy's phone, and I heard your voicemail. on Daisy's phone. Yeah. So maybe I'm not all bad. <laughs>